Hey, Facebook. Oh, my hair's kind of grody. Um, right now, I am in Paris, France. I just flew in yesterday, I think, from Barcelona, where I was filming uh, the rest of the documentary I've been working on with Sean, Sean Cush from the Medical Cush Beach Club. And about four days ago, I started feeling some abdominal pain. And I thought I was just um, getting a little bit backed up. So I started drinking a lot more water, uh, but I just continued to be backed up and my stomach got really big and I was drinking a lot of water and uh, I wanted everything to just kind of go away. Then we got to the end of our trip and we were going to go fly to Paris and then fly back on to the United States. And then right when we landed in Paris, I was walking down the, uh, uh, you know, where we go to go get our baggage and I felt a pop and that pop was extremely painful so I basically I basically was a little freaked out so we rode the taxi to the Hotel Pont Royal and I immediately asked them to call a doctor and luckily in France they have doctors that show up at your you know hotels and he came in and he said well you're not you don't have a fever your blood pressure is okay you have um, you know, you're definitely very backed up. So he prescribed me some, like, you know, expectorant and some things to help me, uh, you know, get everything out of me. And so I was taking that as recommended um, overnight, and I was basically getting up to sort of relieve myself every hour or so, uh, which got the, the big stomach down a little bit. Uh, but the pain was just getting worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. Hey, Hina. Uh, it was getting so bad um, that I was literally, uh, I felt like I was going to die, basically, I felt like I was going to die. So this morning we called Air France and we changed our flights to Sunday, which as it turns out now that I'm in the hospital is probably not long enough, but, um, and then we went to the hospital. So in the hospital, um, they did the, their scans and I'm, I'm on, I think, morphine and antibiotics right now because the pain is so bad, so I can actually talk now, but, um, <laughs> Thanks, Hannah. Um, but anyways, uh, so there's a couple things. On the inside of my holio, there's basically like these little tiny burrs, and they're on the outside wall. And what happened is those little tiny burrs, um, through inflammation, tore a hole in my anus. <laughs> okay. So air is escaping into my intestine, which is causing bloating and a lot of pain. So the best case scenario, um, hi babe, thanks, I'm glad you're coming with all my stuff, I really appreciate it. Uh, best case scenario, um, they're going to try treating me with, um, uh, with medication first to see if the wall will heal itself uh, with the medication. Um, worst case scenario is that they need to bypass my um, anus, I guess you can call it, my uranus, and uh, give me a colostomy bag until uh, the uh, <laughs> Gene. Hey, Gene. How are you, Gene? It's good to see you, buddy. So, yeah, so I'm just in the hospital here. I'm just, you know, giving you an update because I know a lot of you people are probably wondering what's going on, but... Um, well, the worst case scenario is, in fact, surgery to reroute um, the stuff happening down there. And then it would take four to like six to eight weeks for the inflammation to go down to be able to do what's basically removal of that area of anus <laughs> uh, and uh, reconnect it. So I'm just praying the best case scenario is the medication fixes it. So I'm just laying here in bed going, heal, heal the body, heal my body. So any prayers you guys can send, any help. I know it's kind of a weird thing to ask you to help me think about healing my butthole, but I would appreciate it. So um, uh, yeah, any positive things you can send my way, I would really appreciate it. And um, I hope this update helps you guys feel a little bit better. I uh, might not see you very soon, but um, as soon as I get through all this, I'll be right home and 
everything will be back to normal. And um, I can't thank my wife enough. Julie, I love you. You've been a super trooper. Coming into Paris, we were going to spend the whole day together uh, with Genesis. And I ended up just yelling and screaming in the, in the hotel room all day. And she was right there beside me doing everything she could to make me feel comfortable. And, and I love her for it. I love you, baby. I'll see you soon when you get here. Okay, y'all. See you later.